Hey, what's up everyone? Today I'm diving into the heated topics surrounding Funk Flex and his recent comments about Shine and the reactions that have been stirring up the hip hop community. If you're following the news, you know Shine has been reflecting on the infamous 1999 nightclub shooting. So let's break down what Shine had to say about this situation. During the new Hulu documentary, The Honorable Shine, he opened up about the essence of the controversy. He said, I was absolutely set up to be the fall guy. I spent 10 years in prison, but I was able to move on. That's some powerful stuff right there. While many have moved on from the incident, Funk Flex seems to be taking a different stance. He's saying, oh, there's a time to pivot. There's a time to transition. And let's talk about the impact of this statement. I a problem with the dudes he had in the club, not Puff. So I want to make sure, because this has been bothering me for weeks. So when somebody tries to say they the, they the scapegoat, or they, they, like they were used. Trans has been bothering me, and I'm going to keep it a buck. Sean, I, I love you, bro. And I know what you've been through. No, I don't. But you're a liar. You're a stone. When Shine reflected on his past, it was a bold move. This wasn't just a comment. It was a statement. He set the record straight, reminding, reminding everyone of his journey. With words that made everyone think, it became one of the most talked about topics of the year. It's funk flex in his element, combining sharp insight with undeniable presence. So, next time you hear about this controversy, remember it's more than just headlines. It's a bold declaration of seeking the truth. And that's what makes Funk Flex's response so compelling. If you enjoyed this breakdown, hit that like button, subscribe for more, and let's keep the conversation going in the comments. Peace out.